The moment I have not been waiting for, but you guys have. Let's rehouse this huntsman. Why do I do this to myself? Now every time I upload a new video, there is a handful of you guys asking, update on your huntsman. When are you gonna rehouse the huntsman? I know you guys know that I am afraid of huntsmans, and because mine is freaking massive now, let's see how this goes. Hopefully, this goes smoothly, because if it doesn't, there are so many places for her to like literally run, and I don't want a huntsman like this big running around my room. And I have already thought of a way to do this successfully with very slim chances of mistake. So let's see if that works. Let me give you a quick look of the enclosure first. So this is what I've prepared for her. The bottom is a coconut fiber with sphagnum moss as well as forest moss, the exoterra one, as well as a piece of driftwood because these guys, I noticed that they are pretty arboreal. They behave like semi-arboreals, but whatever. A wood in there wouldn't hurt, so let's get her in here. So the first thing I'm gonna do is loosen this cover, put it in here, just like that. Put this cover on, just in case she bolts. Make sure to press it down. And I'm gonna like use this piece of wire, it's like really long, and then like put it through here. I'm gonna knock off the cover, just like that. And then we release the beast. Quite calm. I was actually expecting her to bolt. Let's get her off this container because I want to take it out. Come on, girl, get off. Oh my goodness. There she is. I need her to go down, otherwise, I can't take out the container. It looks like this enclosure is plenty big for her. Whoa, look at her. Ain't she a beauty? Now as you can see, this enclosure is plenty big for her, so this is going to last her a long time. Which I am so glad because I do not want to rehouse this girl again. Well, I probably have to, but that would probably be the last time, and I'm not looking forward to it. So now let's take out that small container, her previous enclosure. Oh, she's already found the underneath of the wood. That's awesome. Now I can confidently open this and take this stuff out quickly don't want to speak too soon and yes mission accomplished so that will be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it may not have been something that you guys expected i'm pretty sure you guys expected something more exciting and hoping that the tea will bolt on me i'm in the huntsman but i had to do this method because i cannot afford to get a huntsman loose in this room well look at that now that is what I call an upgraded enclosure. Before we end, it's time to give a Patreon shout out. So today we have Liam as a party, Xiao Chen, Shane Childers, and Dominic Burring. I'm sorry if I pronounced some of your names wrongly. I probably did. Yeah, I think I did. I feel really bad. Sorry guys. But regardless, I really appreciate all of your support. So thank you so much for your Patreon support. Really, really appreciate it. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to thumbs it up. If you didn't, you know what to do. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notification bell. If you'd like to support through Patreon, there is a link in the description below as well as the social media link. So that'll be great. Really, really appreciate all of your support. So yeah, with that, we end the video here and I'll see you guys in the next one.